New video this hour showing the moments after Broward Sheriff's deputies opened fire in Pompano Beach, killing a suspected bank robber. We first brought you this story at noon as breaking news. The FBI now part of the investigation. Let's get right out to CBS 4's Ted Scouten. And Ted, you've been there all day long. What can you tell us? Well, Najin Lauren, Atlantic Boulevard, East Atlantic has been shut down for more than six hours right now. Take a look. You can see it is still closed right now as investigators here are kind of wrapping up the scene. It looks like they're uh, just about, many of them have already left, but so they're getting ready to probably open up the road, but at the moment it's still closed. Certainly a wild scene this morning, though, when four BSO deputies opened fire on who they say was a suspected bank robber. Yeah, you see it right there. Witness video captured the moment that those shots rang out. This all began in Oakland Park with a bank robbery at the TD Bank. Investigators say the armed suspect took off, BSO in pursuit. Sheriff Gregory Tony said the man was driving recklessly, then eventually crashed into a concrete pole here in the 400 block of East Atlantic Boulevard. Deputies say for eight minutes, he refused to get out of the car. Suddenly, they noticed smoke and flames. At some point, it appears he set the uh, car on fire while he was inside. Um, based on some of the video footage we've been able to see, and at some point got out of the vehicle, presented a, a firearm towards our deputies, and about four of our deputies fired and put the suspect down. Now, at that point, the suspect actually fell backwards into that burning car. Those same deputies who shot him raced to pull him out, uh, pull him out of those flames. Sheriff Tony tells us the suspect was actually on fire. Deputies were not able to save him. Now, at this point, we don't know a lot about that suspect. Uh, we know that the FBI is looking in to see if he is responsible for any other bank robberies here in South Florida. We are also told by the sheriff that he does have a criminal record, but we have no details. We'll have much more coming for, up for you coming up at 6 o'clock. Live in Pompano Beach, Ted Scouten, CBS 4 News.